Hi guys, welcome to Tech Tutorial Guide. In this video, now I am going to show you how to install or upgrade your Samsung Galaxy Grand 2 to latest Android 7.0 market. So, so before that, we need some of the pre recommend First of all, you must have TWRP installed on your device. If you don't know how to install TWRP on your device, so under the description, you may find a video link to install TWRP without using a computer. As I have already shown, a easy way to install TWRP. So then after you have to download Open G apps. So Pico variants uh, for Android Nugget. So and then after you have to download the Synergy Mode 14 ROM, which is available under the description. All the three five things will be available under the description. You can check it out there. So before installing any custom ROMs on your device, you have to take a complete backup. So keep it in mind, you have to take a complete backup before proceeding. So then after what you have to do, your device must be in G7102 variant. So keep it in mind, it won't work with other variants. So here you can find as I'm using stock KitKat ROM on my device. Have a look here. So as I'm using stock KitKat ROM and these three files you have to download. First of all, the OpenG apps and uh, yeah, the Pico version would be recommended. So to get this work, then after Synergy mode 14, ROM. So yeah. These three file thing, three file thing would be available under the description. So please check it out there. So then after what you have to do, you need to boot your device into recovery mode by pressing volume up, power key, and home key at the same time. So keep it in mind, your device may be charged up to 40 to 80 percent. So yeah, just power off your device and then press power key and volume up and home key at the same time. If your device having custom recovery like TWRP means it could be booted directly into TWRP like here they spread volume up power key and home key at the same time so likewise here you can find it will be showing recovery booting so this means my device has been successfully booted into recovery mode so as I've already made a video on team in, installing team in version 3.0 on Galaxy Grand 2 so please check it out the description section you may find this installation guide so then after what you have to do just go to backup section and check everything and just select swipe to backup so before that you can select select storage card so as i'm recommending you to guys just place your backup inside the micro sd so just go back and just select swipe to backup so you can easily restore your current rom using this restore section so here you can find that i've already made it to backups so then after what you have to do, we are going to destroy the data on our device. Just, just select go to wipe section, advanced wipe, select deal with cat system. Now your data has been deleted because you are deleting data partition and cache. So just uncheck internal storage and micro SD. Select swipe to wipe. Now our system has been deleted right now. Now the wiping process has been successfully completed and then go to swipe to factory reset so our device is completely empty right now so we have deleted the system partition data partition so here then after go to install section and find out your current ROM that you have placed in your external storage just select ok and here inside grant 2 just select synergy 14 and this dot zip file Yes, select swipe to confirm flash so now to install the latest android 7.0 on our device so this installation may take 5 to 10 minutes to complete the installation process so you have to be patient and your device might be charged up to 40 to 80 percent here you may find the installation has to be completed right now so here it will be showing unknown command so this would be a not at all error so don't know why it would be TWRP showing while installing Synergen 14 on our device as I have already installed a Synergen 14 on A3 but this error would be shown but this won't touch any files inside the ROM so here that's what you have to do just reboot your system okay. 
so the first booting process should be take up to 5 to 10 minutes so you have to be patient until to complete the booting process so here we have to wipe so here you can find we have successfully installed android n on our samsung galaxy grand 2 after installing android the nougat on your galaxy grand 2 so just power it off your device because we are going to install open g apps on our device so because if we need g app services means we need to install g apps so what we have to do we need to flash the open g apps pico version using twrp recovery so i'm going to power off my device now here you can find it will be showing recovery booting so because we are going to flash where this recovery only So I am on it is strip team win 3.0 so just go to install section and find out your open gapps so that I have provided an onboard link to download this gapps pico variant so just select it and just try to confirm flash yeah now the installation has been completed successfully right now here you can find so just select reboot system now it will reboot our system into sun engine 40. Now we yeah, have successfully booted. So here you can find the list of the Google services have been installed on device. So that's all guys, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel and share with your friends. If you have any concerns about recording this installation, please fulfill in the comment section. Have a nice day. Bye bye. We will see you next video.